just thought about this off the top off the top um, if you're doing big yard cleanup like this or I should say like if you're doing it for yourself try your best to separate the leaves from the sticks Good morning, grinders. Good morning, grinders. Good morning, grinders. <laughs> I'll say today it's a little gloomy. It's like every time we make these videos, it's gloomy. You know, we had like three or four days where it was sunny and then gloom. It's North Carolina weather for you. But anyway, as you can see, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Good little pile of stuff. We didn't actually put this here, <laughs> but we're going to be the ones that actually take it away. So the guy, he actually cleared out his yard and he put this here and we're going to do him a favor by taking it away. The Junk Busters way. Like I said, it's a little gloomy. No big deal. We still go get it in. It's going to be a lot of machinery. It's going to be very loud, but no big deal. Let's, uh, let's rock and roll. So we did about six hours yesterday. Today is a new day. It's a lot prettier. And we go have about like another two hours or so. Knock these bad boys out. It's actually a pretty nice day outside. About time. Just throwing it out there. Step your game up, North Carolina. Give us some nice days. <laughs> um, pro tip. <laughs> Just thought about this off the top. Off the top. Um, if you're doing big yard cleanup like this, or I should say, like, if you're doing it for yourself, try your best to separate the leaves from the sticks. Because, like, when this stuff is compiled like this, you see that? Like, it's really hard to actually even rake it because of the stuff. So, like, if you are doing something like this, instead of putting it in a big old pile, just try to try your best to separate the branches and the leaves together. Unless you're going to burn it. If you're going to burn it, by all means, just put it in a pile. And make sure that your state regulations are good. But, yeah, just a little quick pro tip for today. You know, like I said, because this, it makes it hard. Like, even just raking it makes it hard to actually do it because everything is actually compiled. No big deal. We still in the game, though. What's good, my fellow grinders? Um, we just got done with the uh, yard cleanup. It's pretty big. It was like compact, like, you know, it's just really compact. So as a business owner, I'm gonna just have heart to heart right now. So first of all, I'm tired, super tired. So as a business owner, I know my guys are tired too, right? So I'm gonna go ahead and treat them to some lunch. Like, you know, actually we're gonna go out, go out and, you know, eat some lunch as a team because without them, I wouldn't be able to make the money 
that I want as a business owner because everybody needs help. Everybody needs help. And also as a business owner, you always have to look for innovative ways to increase profits and lower the time of work. That being said, we just spent 10 hours at this job. 10 hours, 10 hours. So you gotta think to yourself, what's gonna cut that time apart, right? Uh, a tractor. So stand by for that. Uh, I'm gonna go buy me a tractor. Yep, I'm gonna go buy me a tractor. So stand by for that. But that's an innovative solution to our current problem. But like I said, 10 hours. I can barely hold this phone up. I my arms hurt. God, arms hurt, body hurt, everything hurts. 10 hours, we still in there. The grind is good, the grind is always good. All right, take care of your people and become innovative in your business. That way you are saving time and profits on everything else. Q, Q, Q. Pretty awesome junk removal. Pretty awesome.